Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Beloved, I greet you all in the name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Today we are talking, still under the umbrella of Premier School of the Prophets, we are talking, uh, we are looking at a topic titled Prophetic Prosperity. I repeat, Prophetic Prosperity. Prophetic Prosperity. See, when you hear the word prosperity, a lot of people think only about money. Prosperity goes beyond money. Like the Bible says in 3 John, I wish I were watching that that may prosper and be in hell, even as your soul prosper. There is prosperity of the spirit or of the soul. There's prosperity of the, of, 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 of the body, which is good health. And there's material or financial prosperity. But when we talk about prophetic prosperity, we're talking about what God has freely given unto you. There are people that God has blessed with good health. They are ever healthy. For many years, they very foresee. They live in divine health and divine, divine healing. It went, when of if there is a, a light, you know, ailment, they enjoy. They don't waste money. They don't spend money on hospital or doctors or whatever. They enjoy divine health. You see, divine health is their heritage from God. Is their inheritance. That's one of them. There are people, but they don't necessarily bad people who, who, who struggle with health issues all, all through their life. They don't have prophetic prosperity in the area of good health. Now there are people who have financial prosperity. God has given them money like dust of the earth, like the sand of the seashells. They have money like dust. They don't merit it. It is just the mercy of God. They did not really labor for it. It is just the favor of God. Like he told Solomon, I've given you wealth. That nobody before you, after you, have what as you do. It is called prophetic prosperity.